So usually on Sundays I'll go to church, but today is state conference and it's broadcasted today, so we're not going anywhere. So this is my hair. My hair is so raggedy, my curls are deformed. I had it in a bun all day yesterday and that's why it's like this. So this is gonna be my week in my life as a music major in college. I'm not gonna be in the practice room today though because it's Sunday and the buses aren't working and I don't even think the music building's open anyways on Sunday. So yeah, I'm not really gonna do anything music related today. Gosh, I'm so tired. My hips like out of place or something, so like, every time I walk, it like really hurts. Okay, I just like flipped my phone around. I'm recording all this on my phone, so like I'm really sorry if the quality is bad. So I just had my first class. So today's Monday. I had my first class, and it was my history class. It was like my third week. I've already missed like a lecture. So like, I'm not off to a great start. But yeah, so I went to today's lecture because you know, it's kind of important to go to your classes. After that, I have no classes until two-ish. That's when I have my orchestra class. And so I'm just gonna be in the practice room. I'm gonna take a lunch break later. So yeah, that's fun. That's like my day today. Like I don't have a lot of classes. Like most of the time it's just practicing. And the reason why I don't have classes is because I tested out of most of my classes. So I'm a music major, obviously. I'm studying heart performance here. And so as a music major, you have to take like music theory and stuff like that but i already take a music theory in high school and i got a five on the ap test that credit transferred over i'm just gonna be practicing i'm gonna start by tuning the harp i obviously don't have my harp with me my harp from home i can bring it and i'm using the studio's harps or the college's harps and so this is one of the harps that i'm using it's pretty <laughs> So this one is the other harp in this practice room. So there's three practice rooms. This is the other one. And this harp is just like my harp back home. So I love it. This one is really similar to my friend's harp that um, my friend back from home. And so it's super pretty. So this one just like kind of brings back old memories. I like this practice room. So as a music major, this is like new for me. I never did this before, but I really like it now that I am doing it. Basically you have to like keep a practice journal. Yeah, so like what I do, I just log the date when I was in the practice room and then like my goals for today's practice and then like notes or like thoughts on how I thought the practice went. The first week was kind of rough because I was like when I was moving into like my apartment and stuff like that. I only got like 19 hours of practice that week for me doing that. So yeah, it's crazy. I used to not practice this much. I don't know how I got into college. Honestly, I really enjoy having all this time to practice. <laughs> like, so yeah, I'm really excited to see how much I like really grow here since I'm working so much harder on music. So I feel like the reason why it's easier to get more practice time is because I'm literally here to study harp. Like in high school, you had to do your math, English, all that stuff. But in college, I already have credit for all of my um, core classes, except for history. That's why I'm taking history. I don't get AP credit for history, but all my other classes I got credit for, so I don't have to take those classes. So I literally only am taking my music classes, my major classes, which is nice. And so after I write down my goals, I'm going to start practicing. Okay, I just finished an hour of practice, so I'm gonna go eat lunch now. I'll be back in the practice room in like an hour. I'm gonna go eat something because I'm starving. I just came back from lunch and I'm in the new practice. Okay, so this is the other harp. There's two other harps in this room. So this room has three harps. Oh gosh, my leg hurts. I'm so tired. I always get really tired after lunch. I did some homework while I ate and now I'm gonna practice and then I have to go to orchestra practice after this. And then I practice for another hour. No, two hours. Yeah, and then I practice for two more hours and then I'm done for the day. <laughs> orchestra practice and it was fun. I'm sitting here and then like literally right here is all the French horns and like they keep dumping their spit anyways. <laughs> 
Good times. So orchestra is fun. I love it. I just finished practicing. I'm really tired. So I'm gonna go home now and eat food because I'm hungry. I straightened my hair. Today is Tuesday and it is currently like 10 a.m. So I'm gonna practice for an hour and then we have a devotional and one of the apostles is speaking, so that's pretty exciting. So me and my friend are gonna go listen to the devotional and eat lunch and then I'll come back to the practice room and then I'll go to my harp master class, which is like the only class I have today, besides Bishop Brett. Anyways, it'll make more sense as I go through my schedule. I explain that terribly. So right now I am just writing in my practice notebook. Yeah, so I'm just gonna continue writing and then Gonna my warm ups. One warm up that I've been really loving is this like seven chord exercise thing. So you start on the G7 and then you go to G65, G43, G42. Like, yeah, you do that. And then you go to F7, do the same thing, and then go to E7, same thing. You just go up and down the harp like that. I don't know if that made any sense, but <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, and the reason why I'm like dressed up in a dress today is because, so today is master class or studio class or whatever you like to call it. So like once a week, all the majors will meet up and then like the teacher will basically give a master class or give some sort of like lesson for everyone, depending on like if people even signed up for the master class. So like the first week, no one signed up to play because I like the first week of college. Like they required that we come into the studio dressed professionally or at least dressed nice. No jeans, no sweat, and I literally wear sweats every day. So I can't remember when I last recorded. I'm doing a terrible job at this whole. We had our heart master class and then right after I had to run all the way to the other side of campus and like literally add four minutes to run to the other side of campus and that is not enough time to run to my mission prep class so i came late to that class and i came back to the practice room so i'm here to practice for like the next two hours and then i'm gonna have my harp lesson i might actually go to the vending machine because i'm kind of hungry right now i'm gonna go to the vending machine because i'm hungry right now <laughs> i have my um, little keychain here <laughs> I'm ready to practice. Yo, I'm trying to tie my hair back because it's really hot in here. I have a fan on over there. <laughs> but I realized I left all my hair ties at home. So I'm literally using a face mask right now. I'm gonna wrap it around my hair. Look at this. Take the earlobe things. Oh my gosh. Gosh, this is terrible. I'm gonna take these clips that I have in my hair to clip back my little baby bangs. There's the fan. I feel a snack break. I love these other butters. They come with a lot of other butters. So like 15 minutes past and my lesson is in like 10 minutes. So, whoa, I got really close to the camera there. Like, there's my snack. This is how much of the Powerade I went through. And yeah, I'm just gonna chill for a second, maybe run through some of my repertoire one last minute, one last time before I go. Now, after my lesson, I'm gonna have another hour practice. And then there's a movie playing that we're supposed to watch for my history class. It's a history movie. And I kind of don't want to go. So I just came back from my lesson. But every time I take a lesson, it like makes me want to practice more. There's, I was going to get more snacks at the vending machine, but there's literally dancers. Like I'm not even kidding. There's dancers dancing in front of the vending machine. Oh my gosh, the harpist before me left her pedals in natural. Whenever you're done playing harp, always leave them in flat. This girl left them all in natural. Make sure they're in flat. Is harp maintenance. Ooh. I'm going to practice again. So it's 11 right now and 
once again, the harpist who's using this harp did not put her pedals up, so I'm gonna put them up and then tune. So today is Wednesday. I missed my morning class. So I'm supposed to like go to my history class or the lecture at 9 a.m., but I slept in and got to school at, at 10. I have my harp ensemble class, but we haven't exactly gotten our repertoire yet. So today we just were looking through the harp like archives to find possible repertoire for us to play. Now I'm here in the practice room and I have an hour in the practice room that I'm gonna go eat lunch with my sister. <laughs> I totally forgot to record. Today I practiced, I went to orchestra, and um, today was good. I think I redeemed myself from last practice where I wasn't loud enough. Now I was very loud, and he, the conductor was very pleased. So pleased, he asked me, are you gonna get blisters? I feel like I'm pushing you too hard. And I was like, I already got blisters, it's fine. Kind of, I don't know if you can see, but it's kind of like torn up there, but it's, it's not bad though. Like I've had worse, so it's fine. I got trolleys. These are so good, they keep me going. Literally, this and Nutter Butters, my current obsession. So yeah, I'm practicing my next class in like two hours, and it's a harp orchestration class. Basically, we learn all these cadenzas. Learn had a better audition for orchestra. I'm really enjoying that class. It's really fun. I just turned on my machine. I'm sorry. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna be practicing for two hours and then I'm gonna go to my class and then I'll go home. <laughs> It's not dark, but it felt like it was really dark outside inside the building. So I thought it was like nine out because it's six. And I'm used to it like the sun going down before six. But here it doesn't go down to like eight. I just missed my bus because I'm walking slow. It literally just left and I'm right now at the stop. <laughs> walking up this hill is terrible. My calves hurt. They're burning. I'm in the practice room and they're regulating harps right now. So there's like a ton of harps in this room just like sprawled everywhere because they're regulating. So that's kind of fun. Anyways, I ate breakfast. I ate some muffins from the vending machine, but I was kind of dumb and accidentally bought two muffins. And so I had one of them and I'm gonna save the other for later. Oh, that's a chocolate muffin. Now this one kind of hurts. Maybe I shouldn't eat chocolate first thing in the morning. Anyways, I'm here to practice. I only have a class at 2 today, so I'm just going to be practicing until then. It's like 10 right now. Okay, so I just had lunch. So they just regulated all these harps here. Check out how nice these pedal felts are. They're so clean because the dude regulated them, you know? All of them are so clean and nice. It's beautiful. And this is like the only salvi in this room or in this entire studio. This is the only Salvi and it's gorgeous. So my two hours are up and my next class is mission preparation. That's in like 10 minutes, so I am now going to go to mission prep. And then I'm gonna come back here to practice some more. Okay, so I just got back from my mission prep class and so I'm gonna practice for an hour and then after that hour, I have a little online Zoom harp lesson where I'm gonna teach one of my old students that I had. I just came from class and I'm really hungry because I haven't had breakfast yet. So I had a 9 a.m. class and that was my history class and we took a quiz and since I didn't go to the lecture on Wednesday, I wasn't the most prepared for this quiz and so I got three out of the five questions. Lucky for me, they dropped the lowest quiz score so hopefully I just do better from now on. I'm off to a great start. Yeah, so I'm gonna practice for the next hour and then I'm gonna eat lunch with my sister and then practice for three more hours and then I'm done for the day. And then tonight I'm going to the Hillary Holland concert with some friends. So that is my Friday schedule. <laughs> So I just finished my three hours of practice and look at my hands. Wow. 
look at that. They are so beat up. So torn. Look at this finger. And look at this finger. My ring fingers for some reason are like dying and falling apart at this point. All right, so now I'm gonna go home. I'm just packing up now and I'm going to eat some dinner, get ready, change it to a nice outfit because I'm literally, I guess I should show y'all what I'm wearing. This is how I dressed every day. Just some sweatpants. These are my Fila sweatpants. Yeah, I just have a t-shirt and sweats every day. That's literally what I wear. Except Tuesdays, I wear a dress because you have to dress up for a master class. I'm like really tired right now. And I don't want to sleep during the Hillary Hahn concert. I want to be wide awake for that so I can enjoy it. Because like, when do you get to listen to Hillary Hahn? Like... Last night we got home at like... 11. The concert was so long, but it was amazing. Hilary Hahn is amazing. And so yeah, that was super fun. So now it's Saturday and I'm just in the practice room. I was supposed to be here at like 11, but I slept in till 12. So I'm now here at 1. I'm practicing now and yeah, that's it. That's like the end of the week. I'm just gonna practice the day, go home, and then like eat and sleep. And then my week starts again.